Hello everyone. It's Saturday and it's round three in Augusta at the 85th Masters. Round two is in the books. Round three starts today. Here's some recaps for you for round two. Justin Rose is still leading. He's seven under. He shot even par yesterday. And the fellows I'm watching pretty closely are Tony Finau, Finau and Cameron Champ. They both are tied for six. Tony shot six under yesterday. And Cameron shot four under. So they seem to be heating up. Tony also, over the first two rounds, has a putting average of 1.33 strokes over the 18 holes. And Cameron has a putting average of 1.61. Now, here's another interesting fact. They are both tied for driving accuracy, having hit 10 of 14 fairways each. They're tied for 39th, but they're tied. In other words, these two players are very close in terms of what they're doing on the course. So there could be a move today. I sure hope to see that. We all want to see Cameron and Tony do well. We want to see all the players do well, but these are two of my favorites, and I think you would agree with me. Uh, it would be quite historic to see uh, one of them uh, win. Here's some other information for you. Um, round two, the hardest hole was number five, which is a par four, 495-yard hole. The easiest hole was number 13, which is a 510-yard par five hole. Number 13, of course, is the end of Amen Corner. Just for comparison, I looked at the entire Amen Corner, 11, 12, and 13. 11, which is a par four, 505 yard, is the second hardest hole. It's a par four, 505 yard par four. Hole 12, which is a par three, is the ninth hardest. And so, folks, when they say the Masters really starts the back nine on Sunday, Amen Corner looms to present challenges to anyone that is in contention. These holes are not the easiest ones to play. Also of interest, uh, to you is the driving distance uh, for uh, Finau. He's hitting the ball an average of 309.8 yards. Average over the first two rounds. Cameron Champ is actually ranked number one in driving distance at 333.8 yards. Yes, if you're interested, Bison DeChambeau is at 327.9. So Cameron is actually out driving him by six yards. Also in round two, that was the cut. That was the cut day. And I learned a long time ago a phrase from a good friend of the African American Golfers Digest, a man by the name of Glennon Basil. Golf don't care. Golf don't care because yesterday several former champs were cut. Sergio Garcia, Mike Weir, Bernhard Langer, Ian Woosner, Freddie Couples, DJ Singh, all were cut. Golf don't care. Phil made it right on the number. He was three over, and again, the cut was four over. This is going to be fun today, watching who's going to make a move. Today is moving day, as they say, in the industry. I'm curious. I'm hopeful. I'm certain you will be. Tune in to Masters.com. 
This is Jim Beatty from the African American Golfers Digest giving you a Saturday recap of round two. I'll have more later on round three. Thank you.